Okay, so this tutorial is sort of specifically for Windows 10, but uh, the command line stuff will work in other versions of Windows because it's existed like forever. If you're like me and you don't really have any reason to use Hibernate, you're probably, you probably have a huge Hibernate file that's just on your hard drive and is just taking up space. And for me, it's a fairly sizable file. And if you're anything like me, you might just want to get rid of it. So let's do that now. Uh, if you go into your main operating system drive here, which in my case is the one called Win10, it's my C drive, and go to View, and then go to Options here, and change folder and search options. Now in here, we just want to be able to see all our files rather than hiding certain files. So I'm gonna move down here, and I'm gonna show hidden files, and I'm gonna uncheck hide protected operating system files and you'll get a little warning about that which looks something like that and just uh, click yes it's fine so now when i click okay i get all this um, additional stuff of course be careful not to delete any of these because they are required for a lot of things but the main file we're interested in here is this hyperfile.sys so um, um, uh, you can see that it's 13 gig you know it's more than 13 gig in size it's a huge whopping file that's doing absolutely nothing because I never have any intention of using Hibernate. So if you do a Windows S, so press the Windows key and press S, that then comes up with the search, just type CMD. There are various ways of getting to this. You can just type CMD and then go into the administrator. Lots of ways of getting to this, but this is just a nice easy way. So Windows S to search, CMD, and then it'll come up with command prompt here. Right click on that and do run as administrator because you need to be in an elevated command prompt. So it needs to be an administrator command prompt. It needs to say administrator just here. And now just type power config, power CFG, dot exe which you may not need forward slash h for hibernate or you can type forward slash hibernate and then off and that's it so that just set tells windows i have no interest in using hibernate turn it off and immediately if i go back to here we don't need a restart it's just removed that file and i've now freed up nearly 14 gig of space on my hard drive just by turning hibernate off. So just going back to that command again, power config forward slash H off. Simple as that. Old, it's an old Windows command, been around for ages, but I always forget to do it. Every time I put an operating system on or build a new computer, I always forget to do it. Thanks for watching. See you soon.